What's up guys? Uh, we're out fishing again today. Uh, we're going to be taking out a skiff, uh, renting a skiff here in Capitola. Um, fishing with today with Ish with Fish again. And uh, we're going to see what we can do. The good thing about uh, these skiffs is that anyone can rent them. So I mean, some people think, you know, you can't catch sling cod unless you have a boat or you can't go out in the, in the deep sea for a halibut, you know, unless you you have a boat or you know someone who has a boat um, but that's not true uh, I've never owned a boat and, and I rent these skiffs all the time so that's one nice thing about the skiffs here is anyone can rent them so we're gonna go take one out today uh, I just dropped him off at the pier we're gonna go park and we're gonna head out uh, I think we're gonna start off getting some live bait try to find some in the marina here and then we're gonna head out and try and find some either link powder halibut and we'll see what we can get Fish. All right, mid morning update. Couldn't find too much live bait, so we're uh, resorting to some jigs, swim baits. And we got a friendly but not so friendly competition with another boat uh, for biggest. Biggest fish, non shark, right. tip to tip. Uh, let's see what we get. Game on. It's not huge. I think it is. Can I get the camera out? I think it's a link card. Oh, small halibut. Nice. All right, here's our first halibut. We need one about like 10 times the size. So the legal size on these is 22. This one's probably like 18 or so. Let him go. Yeah. You find the spot and then we'll uh, we'll catch the fish in. Yeah, I think I got a cut on here. Yeah. Oh yeah, Too friendly. Fishing. Damn, son. That should keep. Hell yeah. First lady mini of the day. You running drag out? Yeah. <laughs> Just woke up. Take my time. Yeah. 
All right, first one. Measure him just to make sure. Nice die hard, is he gonna keep? Yep. 24. Alright, what's the limit? 18? 22. 22? Oh, They're bigger, easier to see. There he goes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I think it's kind of small. I think it's a small length. Oh, rockfish. Yeah. Another brown rockfish. Alright, here comes DFG. Okay. We got one link cut and a few rockfish. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Is that good? Perfect, that's good. Thank you guys. Cool, man. We survived. Dude, every time I'm in Santa Cruz or Capitola, they always roll up on me. Every time you're in a video, I get checked. What's going on? So I'm free. The fish were just. It was sun tanning weather, not fishing weather. Yeah. Your lucky day. Back at home, uh, we labored long and hard. We fished it hard, but it was a little bit slow today. Uh, we did manage to get a few rock cod. Uh, I got one short halibut and some smaller link cod. But we did manage to get one link cod, so we're gonna do a catch and cook with the link cod. Um, but first step, we gotta fillet it up. So we'll do that now. We got our uh, ling cod all cleaned up and ready to go. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to put some of our ingredients in this uh, Ziploc bag here. So we got salt, garlic powder, flour, and pepper. That's what we're going to start off with. Okay, so now we got our ling cod cut up. We're going to throw it in this bag with our seasoning. Seal up 
empty bag. Seal it up. All right, I'm gonna shake this up. Make sure it's on all the fish. All right, let's do the trick. All right, next step, move up an egg. So now we got our wok here. We're gonna fill it with oil, just enough to coat the bottom. Don't need that much. We're gonna wait for that to heat up. All right, it's the best part. We can test to see if it's hot. Yep, we're good to go. Okay, so we got our fish here. And our egg here, and all we're gonna do is we're gonna take this fish, dip it in the egg, and then throw it in the hot oil. All for about five minutes. All right, so he's been cooking for about five minutes. Now it's time to flip them. I think they're about ready to take off. Okay, so for our meal, we got our fish cooking here, our second batch. Those are done. We got artichoke. On the stove here. And then we got fries in the oven cooking. That's gonna be our fish and chips. Looking good. Fish and chips with artichoke. It's time to eat. First bite the fish. Phenomenal, really good. It's really good. Alright, let's try the fries. Mm. Also really good. Very good fries. Fries the best part of the meal. My wife cooked the fries, so I'm just gonna put that out there. That's the best part. The artichoke. Fish is also good, but fries. All right, we'll try the artichoke now. It's the artichoke too. Everything good. Fries are the best, but everything is good. Sit. Shake. Down. Roll over. Keep going, roll over. No, roll over. There you go. 